It was all go today in the bike category, which saw Toby Price take his first stage win of this year's Dakar Rally and surge into sixth place overall. The Australian finishing over two minutes clear of Luciano Benavides. Sadly, though, his brother Kevin Benavides retired from the rally today when his engine let go. It's really, really sad, you know, we push all days, we, we risk a lot just to, to be in the front to try to, to, to fight. I also I want to, to defend that number one. We did also a good job all the year and then in one second everything is, is out. So, yeah, I feel so bad, but it's like this, I can it's not my fault. Sam Sunderland. He lies second and with a good road position tomorrow, the Brit is one to watch. In the cars, Stefan Petterhansel also took his first stage win of this year's Dakar, which means each Audi has now won a stage this year. Nasser Alatir, who picked up a five-minute penalty late yesterday as a result of not redoing up his safety belts before moving, finished six minutes off the pace, but he continues to lead by over 30 minutes from Sebastian Loeb. To finish and without any losing uh, a lot of time, uh, we lose only one minute from Sab, you know. Tomorrow it's a good road position for us and uh, we are quite happy. Today, uh, no puncture, uh, no nothing's... Uh, issue with the cars you know navigation was good with Matthew and uh, yeah we are uh, step by step <laughs> in the lightweight class Seth Quintero added another stage victory to his tally leading from the start of today's test that win means he equals the record previously set by Pierre Latigue it's mind-blowing it's been a, a crazy few years trying to get to this point unfortunately out of the overall but uh, I think this is uh, just as sweet so maybe we can get one or two more and uh, break that record I believe that record was set back in 1994, uh, which was quite a few years before I was alive. So, <laughs> And finally, in the trucks, Dmitry Sotnikov was once again the man to beat in his 2022 spec Kamaz. Just under 1 minute 30 quicker than his teammate and main rival for overall honours, Eduard Nikolev. 